Hello and welcome to another video from the Voyager Steam Lab. Uh, this video is a quick one that's going to help people with their orthographic projection quiz. Um, this is how to use the uh, different ways of cutting away at an object. So we know how to extrude something and that's what I've done here. This is an extruded cube. It's 40 by 40 by 40 millimeters. Um, and I just made a, a rectangle and I smart dimensioned the bottom and I extruded it to 40 millimeters. So it's a 40 millimeter millimeter cube. So sometimes when we're trying to match uh, an object to some a plan, sometimes it makes sense to cut away at the plan. So I'm going to we've in the past we've only used the whole wizard, but just the way we can make things, extrude, revolve, sweep and loft, we can extrude, revolve, sweep and loft cuts as well. So I'm going to just show you a couple of these. Um, for example, if I wanted to use extruded cut and I chose this circle that I have on the top here, by default, it's going to go all the way through. I can change my in direction. I can change how deep it goes. Um, I can make this hole go only part of the way down um, and hit check. And you made a hole. You can't really see the hole. I can do that by just switching this to hidden line mode. I can really see how deep I went. Okay. So I can do different view modes there. That's a hole. I can also extrude a hole just by clicking on a sketch. I can get this little arrow that pops up, and it's an extrude arrow. So if I pull it up, it extrudes up. If I pull it down, it cuts it away. It goes down. So that can be very useful, a quick way to turn a sketch into an extrusion. Sometimes I want my holes to go at an angle. So this is a triangle, and then I've got a separate sketch of a line that goes down the face here. So if I use a swept cut, I can sweep this sketch along this line like that, and instead of adding to it since I'm using cut it will cut that part away so that was just a quick way of showing you how to take away from an object instead of add up to make an object and that'll do it for this video